Hi, my name is Julian Lester, and I like to audition for the characters I come up with, including Barack Obama, Joe Petty, and Arnold Schwarzenegger for the Bird Mike Production Studios. Doctor, no. I don't think it's political at all. Seems like when I'm blowing off hot air with my not-so-close foreign friend, my close friends get ticked off and yell at me. You can't say that anymore. It's not politically correct. Then I get ticked off because they never tell me what that means. Times have changed, good buddy, and you must change with them. It's all in the tongue. Political correctness is all in the tongue. Oh, no ballot, no voting, no election, and no politics. That makes no sense to me. Let's stop this, guys. They look pretty famous. Maybe they can help. What does he need to know, kid? I was just on my way to pirate with Stormy Hoagie and Italian Ice. I like joining it too. It's good for the brotherhood. But I'm meeting up with a couple of buddies. Hey, what's on your mind? H hold on. Hey, Joe. You're right on time. We're doing Chinese or Sobo tonight. It makes my day when I hang out with my homies. It's a wonderful thing when our worlds collide in fine dining. Oh, here comes Arnold. Late as usual. Brock, Joe. I parked in front of the barber shop around the corner from Chinatown. I was hungry for stir fry, but now my mouth is watering for stuffed dumplings and polished sausage. That's the winner, Artie. We'll stick with the plan. But remember, we are free, hungry, but famous men. When we order our food, we can't just be ourselves because folks are listening. We must be politically correct, not that stuffed dumpling and polished sausage bologna. It's called pierogies and kielbasa. You got that? It's all about who's listening. I'm even more confused. Hello, my good fellow. There is a question that has been boggling my brain for some time now. You look like a reasonable chap. So can we chat for a few seconds? Hmm, I'm kind of busy. And my words may not have a lot of work in it. Most people find me a little strange. But it's funny you think I'm reasonable. I'm impressed with that assumption. Hmm... Hmm, very interesting. Wait a minute, maybe I could put on my thinking cap and come up with the answer. Hey there, uh, pardon my intrusion, but I overheard you say you got a big question that needs an even bigger answer. Well, sir, you may be wasting good time and energy on someone who clearly can't help you. What are you aching about? I've got barrels of wisdom just to be waiting to pop out. Yes, um, and my friends call me Dr. No. You get it? No? With a K and W? Front and back? <laughs> what is the difference in right but not politically correct? I guarantee he doesn't know. Hmm. I can smell the fear of the unknown oozing out of his brain. Hey there! A lady's strolling a little tot to the end of the street. And uh, hey there, can you park a minute? This fine chap has a question about politics. Thank you.